Welcome. So, what's all this? An artifact stolen from the vault, and it turned up in Lorca Rain. I see. You'll want to start with the vault itself. I'll dispatch Oathblade Gwyn Anway to guard it. Meet her there when you're ready. The vault lies south through Tala Rain, on the way to the walls. Head south through Tala Rain. Then look for the small pass into the walls. Oathblade Gwyn Anwy will be waiting for you there. Good luck. Powerful relics stolen from our vaults, and they send a single pledge shield. Have they gone completely mad? Who knows how many like it were in that vault, and how many stolen already? Let's go in. We'll see what we find there. You'll see in a moment. The outer doors are open, but that's no concern. It's the inner door that's always locked. Only Grian has that key. Come, this way. in a door that shouldn't be open mages are these the same ones from brigand hall you there stop at once Ah! <laughs> 
found this in the leader's hand. It's the key to the vault. Or maybe a copy of it. Can't tell for sure. No knowing how many times they've been in here when they knew I wasn't about. We were lucky to come when we did. Return to Helmgard. Gry and Shane won't like this, but he'll have to hear of it all the same. I must report to Gryan immediately. Meet back at Helmgard station. Glad you're here. I've taken the precaution of jailing Gwyn. A bit heavy-handed, I know. But this is a serious matter, and only necessary until we've cleared this up. That vault was hers to watch over. This can't help but put her under suspicion. We have a small jail at the back of the keep. Useful enough, between the freemen and other sorts you find on the plains. Well, on the one hand, she was always consumed with all that dusty history, but it just doesn't seem like her. Fact is, if not Gwyn, someone helped those mages get in. But who and how? She never mentioned a key. Withholding evidence as well. The girl brewed so. I suppose I'm not surprised. I do want to know what became of that key. Something else, Pledge Shield. An artifact. Gwyn's guilty on the Crudic's arse. Don't tell me you believe I had a hand in this. After all you've seen, this is a nightmare. I do, but I blame the Warsworn leadership so much more. After my parents, after all my warnings. What is the saying? They who ignore the past are fated to repeat it. But Gryan would rather sweep this under the rug. That is why I'm here. My parents were loyal Warsworn. But the Order turned its back on them. They would not help, let alone... Forgive me. I am not used to talking of such things. You will surely face more of those mages. In my strongbox by my bed, you will find a ring of mothers. I want you to have it. I wish I knew. Today's wars were not heroes or demon slayers. Just mercenaries. Soldiers. Gryan Shane is a shining specimen of the modern Warsworn. That our old enemy still lurks somewhere in the shadows? Yes, often and always upon deaf ears. The key! God damn it, he was in such a rush to throw me in here, I forgot. Take it, show it to Gryan. If it is a copy, I know a master locksmith in Tyran's rest who might be able to help. First, speak with the Castellan. If the key is a copy, then you must seek the Master Locksmith in Tyran's rest. An artifact? this now? A key? 
key found among the vault intruders. I see. Well, I can say for certain that it's not the original. That was the first thing I checked after you went off to the vault. Ah, yes, the gnome. Uh, Tarion. He'd know something of how this was done. Did Gwyn suggest this? She always did have a head for these things. Although, if she's behind this, the gnome could be a trap. Be wary, Pledge Shield. Thank <laughs> you. 
For truly, my children, we are loved and blessed by Lyria. Lyria, goddess of fate, who holds the cards that spell our mortal lives. Though she holds dear, prosper, and thrive, yet the strong and the proud... You're in here somewhere. <laughs> I have you to thank. You and my clever hiding place. Can't imagine what those churls were after. They kept barking on about the war sworn this and kill me that. But now tell me, what can I do to repay you? A brief lesson in the art of locks, perhaps. What? Do you mean it didn't work? Ah, this is one of my greatest achievements. I recreated that ancient marvel perfectly. I promised that pledge shield. Uh, Fenin. Fenin, that was her name. I, I promised her. Surely she had permission, yes? She swore to me. Oh. I see. For pledge shield Fenin, yes. Now, if you will see yourself out, I have a mess to clean up.
not a stain anywhere, do you understand? The locksmith pledge shield Fenin, you say? Stole my key, had it copied, handed it to the enemy. We must confront her at once. Tori! Henry! Seize her! Pledge shield Fennens in the cells now. Go see if she'll talk. We've got to get to the bottom of this. Yes, yes, indeed. The duty's yours. I think she will tell us what she knows. Want to war? Greetings. She went willingly enough. Strange that. Right. I'll confess. I'm ready. I know I can never make amends for the deaths I've caused, but I will try. I stole the key and had it copied. I gave it to... He swore he worked for the Alfar army, that this could end the war. I knew they were stealing powerful things from that vault, but he said the War Sworn were refusing to use them in the war against the Fae, so they... we... Could keep getting paid to fight. A man named Elvin Merrock. I knew him from. That does not matter. He said he's a soldier in Tewilly, though we always met pretty far south of the barracks, near the way into the marsh. In the army, as I said. The only place I've ever seen him is with his friends, where Tewilly joins Akatha. Given this turn of events, you are to find this Merok character. Extract from him what you can. I have other work for Gwyn. Meet her in Rathir when you're done. Or the army? Help with the war? My gods! Though she holds dear, prosper, and thrive, yet the strong and the proud fall beneath her displeasure. Go in peace, be guided and blessed by Lyria, my children.
For 500 summers, autumns, winters, and springs, the blossoms on my pearl tree bloomed ceaselessly and wantonly in vain. Why today have they fallen like tears? A dark doubt whispers, these flowers will not come again. <laughs> What's this here? A little soldier, come wandering down the coast? And just who are you? How do I know you're not that meddler? Best I kill you first and bring them word myself. <laughs> I'm going to enjoy this! Really, but they answer to somebody called Mad Harst. They're inside, or rather under the Revere Customs House. I've never been in, but there's a password. In my fear, yes. But there's a password, and I don't know it. You'll have to find your own way into the Hornet's Nest.
maze is just too expensive. Don't miss the sea foam tavern. Well, who can I send? Tell me, what cost the lot by sea? I thought the meddler was taken care of along with the gnome. Go on, Harst will want to hear this. Very heroic, my fine little war swan. You have tracked and fought your way to my very door, but the vault has been emptied and Lord Beeson has flown, flown to Eamon's Isle. You don't even know, do you? Your own history. Well, let it stay buried. Out of your hands, out of mine, and in Beeson's. Fear not. The Farlangi shall bring a beauty terrible and sublime into the world. Now!
Beeson. The Beeson. If it's true he's gone to Eamon's Isle, we must follow immediately. I know a ship's captain here in the city. Hopefully Captain Gomform isn't already hired. Take this, a token from Delfric himself. We should send word of our discoveries to him immediately. As soon as a ship can be chartered, yes. Search for Captain Gomform on the docks. If he has a ship free, I believe he will take us. You, bring word to ancient Delphic. Now, let's get to the keys. <laughs> 